Hey guys, what's going on? It's JCW Gamer here. Today, Skybound has given us an official release date for The Walking Dead, the final season, episode 3, and a build-up trailer to go along with it, with a little snippet of episode 3 gameplay in the actual trailer itself. So I'm going to let you guys take a look at that, and I'll talk about the build-up trailer after. See you in a minute. I guess the world got pretty hard since I left it. Kid growing up in it, he'd be hard too. You're in my shoes now. parents went on vacation and never came back. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we tried to make it. It didn't work. You're strong, Clem. You can do anything. Still not bitten. So there we are guys, I do want to say every time Telltale or Skybound I should say now releases a trailer for The Walking Dead like this I do actually get a bit emotional inside because it's just always a rundown of like the previous games of The Walking Dead leading up to how Clementine has grown up in this zombie apocalypse, I wouldn't say zombie apocalypse sorry I'll say walker apocalypse unless you're Lee and you're playing episode 1 or season 1 because Lee actually said zombie twice in season 1 so he broke the fourth wall there but the any episode 3 gameplay we got out of that was when uh, Lily was with AJ, I wouldn't say alone, but here's the scene here, and uh, AJ's got like a rundown of blood on his left cheek, obviously um, AJ's not alone because it's always from Clem's perspective, right, so we've got Clementine and AJ, obviously we can't see Clem in the trailer here, but we are next to AJ and he, he literally hates Lily, obviously just like us, literally I don't care what Clementine you are, if you're nice or bad Clementine, you just, you just do hate Lily, and I don't know why you would like her, but I mean, yeah, she might have been decent in season 1, but this time she's not so yeah you're just not allowed to like her if you do just get in the bin you know binge you can get in them right yeah just get in it so as you can see uh, AJ she's pointing little gun things at Lily she doesn't look impressed she's like literally like your scrub AJ that's literally what she's thinking in her head but uh, I literally when I first saw that I thought he had a black eye I was like whoa I need to do like I need to, I need to comment on this but uh, no he's, he's blatantly as you slow it down as you literally watch it it's him closing his eye doing the pointing little gun fingers at her just like you know bang! I don't know what Clementine's thinking because we can't see her face, but I'm probably suspecting she's thinking the same of AJ, like, bang, to Lily, because AJ also hates Lily, good on him. But it looks like a house in the background from the rugged walls, but obviously it's a raider's camp because uh, from the cliffhanger with Abel, we've kidnapped Abel, we're going to save everyone they kidnapped, and we've just kidnapped Abel, so it's kind of funny. But, you know, they've kidnapped our people, we've kidnapped one of their people, so we're going to do a little trade. Uh, there's going to be a lot of death, I, I assume. Um, I don't know if there's any more, you know, returning characters. I'm, I'm pretty sure that was confirmed. I'm not sure they, there will be, but I mean, I can say for a fact, actually, there is going to be a returning character. But uh, I was saving that for the ends because everyone who watched the trailer just then, you, the first thing, thought, thing you thought was like, oh my god, no way, he's back. So Lee, we heard in the trailer. Uh, like I said, this is going to be emotional when Lee's when we hear Lee's voice. Obviously, he's gone, so we're not actually. Gonna, we, in fact, right, we might see him in the flashback. I'm thinking it's going to be like one of those uh, Bates Motel stuff, you know, with like I don't know if you've seen it at uh, Norman Bates Motels on Netflix, right? So uh, Norman, he's with his mother, and he can literally hear his uh, mother inside of his head throughout the whole like show show when she's not with him or when she died. So. Uh, I, might, I might have just spoiled it for you, don't watch it anymore. But yeah, like I, what, what, what my point is, is I think like we're going to hear certain stuff we do. I don't think Clementine's going mental though, I don't think she's going mad. So I don't think we're going to hear Lee like in our heads, because we're not going mad. I think we're only going to see him in flashbacks. But from the trailer, we didn't see Lee, we only heard him in our head. Well, we just heard him for the, you know, the background of the trailer to make it like even more sad than it already is. So I don't know how it's going to play out if we're going to get another flashback like Season 2, Episode 5. I kind of hope it is, because we all want to see Lee again. 
again, obviously, because everyone loves Lee. Is ever this is what everyone's been wanting? Lee to come back. Season two is Lee coming back somehow? Season three is Lee coming back somehow? Season four is Lee coming back somehow? And it finally is happening. It just, he just didn't turn up at all at season three. There's always been references of Lee. We've always, always talked about Lee in every season to every new character we've met, pretty much. But uh, yeah, from the leaked models that we got, it's pretty obvious that we are going to see him in the flashback. And I did say it might be episode three and not episode four we see him, but we might see him in both three and four most likely if he will be in both if he is in our head the whole time and we start seeing him or something um and also lee's voice is just is very interesting because um i did a soundboard troll right on lee right i, I used lee as a soundboard troll on the playstation and you know trolling people randomly on in the parties right and one guy said and he had no clue who he was and he was like his voice is very majestic i was like you know what, I kind of agree with that. But no matter how they bring Lee back, it's just going to be so sad to hear his voice again. And I will be doing a series on my channel because I'm currently doing a series on The Walking Dead, the final season. So if you haven't seen my episode 1 and 2 gameplay, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And one last final thing, the most important thing, which is obviously in the title, you guys want to know, is the release date. You probably saw it at the end of the trailer, but it did say the 15th of January 2019. So we will be getting it at the start of next year. I'm so glad it's coming up then. I want it to be dragged out because otherwise, this month month it would have been the end of the walking dead the final season and i don't want it over yet at least it's going to be extended a few things might have changed because it's from skybound now uh get, get you just you know new maybe game mechanics and stuff and i just can't wait to play it and it does look like it obviously will be the same graphics and stuff because of the trailer we got but i cannot absolutely i literally i'm so excited as you can tell um i, I remember from this when i started recording episode two i was literally so excited i literally just jumped straight into the episode i literally just like hey guys what's going on right let's play <laughs> so i literally could be like that with episode three and four i cannot wait um yeah so that's gonna be it guys if you did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and if you're new around here don't forget to subscribe i messed up my outro but if you're new around here um yeah do subscribe obviously and leave a comment what you thought about the trailer possibly about the return of lee maybe the little snippet of episode three gameplay we got in the trailer and just your thoughts in general so that is gonna be it guys if you did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and i will see you in the next one peace Time to go, Clementine. You've got people that need you.